Hey guys, I'm Dana with Faith at Home, and I have got a full body strength workout with a little bit of a cardio finisher. A couple, about three times that we're gonna do cardio, but for the most part, this is full body strength, okay? Everything is mod modifiable. I'm going, um, I've got two sets of dumbbells because I don't have my 15s with me today. So I've got 12s and I've got 20s. Um, some of these exercises I can do with 20s, so I'm just gonna switch that up. But you really stick to your medium sized dumbbell. Um, whatever that is for you, okay? Beginners, I suggest five to eight. Um, intermediate, anywhere from 10 to 15. And advanced, 15 to 20 or 12 to, 12 to 20, okay? Um, we're gonna get started though. And as you know, I've got a warm up on my YouTube. So I'm hoping that you can use that um, to kind of get you going with, um, I've already done a couple of demos. I'm gonna turn this down, because we're a little loud. Um, but it should take about 20 to 25 minutes, I'm not sure. There's um, five exercises, and we're gonna just repeat these three times. So all, all five of these exercises three times. Your rep count, and I say this a lot on my Instagram page, but in Facebook, your rep counts should be um, challenging. That last rep should be challenging, but so it's up to you whether you wanna go eight reps, 10 reps or 12 reps, okay? I'm gonna stick with 10 reps today, so we're gonna go about three rounds with 10 reps, okay? Let's get started. I'm just gonna go a little bit of some arm circles because um, those 20s, I haven't been using the 20s this morning. I've just been doing the 12, so. Let's get started. We've got compound movements today, full body, pretty, um, some of these moves can be challenging, but I trust that you can modify what you need to. You know I'm gonna always give you an option, okay? So we're gonna start off with a step out to hammer curl. So step out each side, hammer curl in the middle, okay? We've got 10 reps or eight reps if you've got heavier dumbbells today. Here we go in three, two, and go. Squat, curl, that's one, two. This is a hammer curl, so palms face each other. Here's four. Five, six, seven, there's eight. And last one. You will notice that heart rate is gonna be going up today with these exercises because we're involving the entire body. Hmm. Next exercise, we're gonna go into a reverse lunge we're gonna swing down with that dumbbell and come overhead to like a front raise, front press. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try 20s with this. Not sure how many I can get, but shoot high, right? Okay, reverse lunge to that high press. In three, oh yeah, you're swinging on the same leg that's going back, just to let you know. Three, two, and go. So swing and press, there's one. It's a little bit of a momentum. Um, whoo, momentum check here, four, five, we're going to go five and five, so we don't um, injure that shoulder <laughs> with too many, but it is challenging with these 20, so do what you can, next side, here we go, reverse lunge, press, there's one, two, three, Four, last one. Whoo, that is tough. Five. Okay. Heart rate is up. How about you? Next one. This is a really, I love this one. Deadlifts are my favorite exercise. But we're going to travel with it and add an upright row to it, okay? So this is how it looks. We're going into a staggered deadlift row at the top. There's one, two. You're just going to the distance of your mat, three, or whatever workout space you're doing, four. Turn it around, five, six, seven. Woo, two more. I really challenged myself with these 20s. And last one. Nice job. Okay, I'm gonna go to my 12s. 
Check my arms out. We're going to be in a kneeling position for this. If you cannot kneel, you can stand for this, but we're doing a unilateral side. I like the kneeling. So grab one dumbbell. I like the kneeling position because it allows you to really use that upper body without the lower. And as you notice, I have a mic today. I got a new mic, so y'all can hear me, but now you have to hear me breathe. So, <laughs> so super annoying as well, but bear with me. Here we go. We got a lateral kneel. And we're gonna go into half rainbow curl, into a bicep curl. That's one. Here's two. We're gonna go five and five. Here's three. Four, you're working a lot of shoulder in that curl. Last one, I mean this side curl, this rainbow curl, and then the bicep with that curl, okay? Other side, legs should be out, lateral. Here we go, half rainbow curl, and forward we got that bicep curl. Here's two. Three, you'll feel your core really activate as well because you're battling if you're kneeling, because you're in this position right here. Last one, curl and down. Okay, on the ground. I've got to use my lighter reps on this because we're gonna be doing an iron cross, which is basically a fly, chest fly with an elevator, okay? So we're incorporating abs and arms here. Start here at the top, catch your breath, and then down to that fly and elevator and up. There's one, two, three. If you've got heavy dumbbells, you can also just press it out. So right here and press. So give me that chest press or work the chest, I should say. There's five, six, seven. Eight, nine, last one, and 10. Whoa, my husband's in here working out with me and making a lot of noise So, <laughs> with his dumbbells. Okay, that is it. We're gonna go back to the top. You can adjust your rep count if you want, keep it the same. I'm gonna keep us the same with those 10 reps. Let's go, second time through these, we've got that step out, step out squat to that camera curl. Okay, here we go. Three, two, and go. Step out and curl. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, whew, eight, nine, and 10. Holy arms. Breathe it out, take a break. Get a drink of water if you need to. We're gonna go into that reverse lunge and that unilateral high swing, okay? Five and five, or four and four if you're at eight reps. Okay, here we go. Same leg, same arm that swings. Overhead. Use those legs to power up that dumbbell. Two more, whoo, five, good. Other side, huh, come on, we got it. One, two, if that's too hard for you, just come right here to your shoulder line, okay? Four, last one, and five. Good job. Okay, we've got the walking staggered deadlift to that upright row. Come on, let's go. Here's one. Two, these combos are kickers today. Three. Four, five, six,
six. You're alternating those legs. Seven. Oh my gosh, two more. If you're having horrible form, then you need to stop your reps. Okay, if you feel like you're compromising form to get them all in, I would rather you have good form with less reps, okay? Two more exercises. We've got the kneeling, lateral kneel, hammer curl, or sorry, half rainbow to bicep curl. Not many breaks today, okay? Full body, get it done. Um, only five exercises. They take your breaks when you need to, okay? You hear how heavy I'm breathing, so this is not easy today. Let's go, lateral kneel, we got a half rainbow, and bicep, there's one, we got five. Two. Three. Four, heart rate should come down just a little bit on this, and five. I'm gonna turn up this music, because Other side. My husband kind of hates me right now. Okay, here we go. Half curl, half rainbow, bicep. There's one, two, three. You can probably use about 20s on that. There's four, last one, and five. Iron cross on the ground. We've got chest fly with that elevator. Okay, here we go. Last one, we got one more round after this. Let's finish strong and go. Fly, elevator. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two more. Okay, drink of water, rest out a little bit. One more round. Back to that step out squat, to that hammer curl. We sticking, you sticking with me? You got this? Make sure you comment below. Let me know if you got this one done, because you're a rock star. <laughs> okay, step out squat, hammer curl. Back to my 20s, let's go. One. Two, three, four, six, seven, two more, and ten. You notice I took out the cardio blasters? There's a reason, because I hadn't done this workout fully yet. We don't need them. <laughs> Got enough cardio mixed in with these exercises. Okay, reverse lunge, that unilateral swing, overhead, or you're coming into that half curl, or half, basically a hammer curl. Come on, let's go. Three, two, go. Here's one. Get it up there, two, three, Four and five, other side. Two, three, four. Holy moly. I gotta take a breather. I bet y'all too. Uh, all good. Hey, this is tough, and I underestimated how tough it was, but I also pushed myself using heavier dumbbells, so you always have that option. If it's too hard for you, take out your rep counts or go down on your weights, okay? There's multiple options instead of just throwing in the towel, okay? Okay, we've got three more exercises and we're done, y'all. 
deadlift, walking deadlift, upright row. Here we go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, halfway. Keep going. Six. Seven. Two more. Okay. Check it out. We're going to that kneeling position, which if you're kneeling or sitting for that or standing, but you're not using your lower body, your heart rate will come down because you're not using as many muscle groups here. Okay. Half rainbow, bicep in three, two, let's go. And front bicep curl. There's one, two, three. You ask like, what muscle groups are we working today? All of them, <laughs> all of them. And that's the good thing about full body. You get the best bang for your buck, get them all worked out, other side, and get done in 20 minutes, okay? We've got three more. Here's four. And last one. Five, iron cross. Let's finish strong right here. Last one, chest fly with an elevator. Three, two, and go. One. Remember, drop it down to one dumbbell and give me a chest press if you cannot do the fly. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Woo! And done. Sit right here for a minute. Y'all survive? I'm proud of you for even getting on here and attempting or finishing, okay? That's how you get stronger. Make it a habit, be disciplined, and be consistent. Love you guys. Thanks for tuning in.